Lives are the most valuable thing in Balloons Tower Defense. I mean, if you run out of money, that's fine. But if you run out of lives, the game's over. So very obviously, they're the most important thing. But what would happen if you have to spend lives to upgrade towers? Would that change the game strategy? Or what would even happen? Is it even possible to win? Let's find out. Before we jump into today's video, I have something very important to say. I hope you have a great day, my friend. All right, so we need to decide what hero we want to use. We want to use a hero that's going to restore our lives. There's two heroes that come to mind. We have Quincy with Quincy's ability that comes in at level 6 cybersecurity, which restores five lives at the end of each round. There's, And then I think it also upgrades. Doesn't it upgrade at like... When does it upgrade? It upgrades. There we go. Level 14, cybersecurity adds 10 lives per round. It can go up to 100 over starting lives. But there's also our boy Geraldo. Where where does Geraldo get his... At level 11, he gets a Reju Potion. Resets all monkeys towers, restores 50 lives. So this is, the, this is the thing. Resets all monkey tower and hero cooldown and restores 50 lives. So 50 lives for Benjamin, and that's a total of 10 rounds. But I think you can only get two, so that's 20 rounds. I think Benjamin is the better... Oh... But, but Geraldo also is able to pop things. I think, I think we're gonna go with, with Benjamin in the house. All right, so apparently we, we can put, we can buy things and we can buy T1 towers and that's fine. But to upgrade them costs lives. So it says $5, but that's the equivalent of how many lives it takes. So we could get quick shots, very quick shots, and then we can go ahead and get like triple shots. So we have a triple shot dart monkey. But here's the thing, we're not gonna generate any lives, right? So we're gonna wanna put Benjamin down. So how do we get lives? Um, we need a heli pilot. So we wanna get a heli pilot, and then we wanna get bigger jets, IFR, downdraft, Oh no, support Chinook's 125 lives, and I have only 125 lives. Do I just lose? But that's the only way to get lives. Do I? Oh my gosh, I just lose like that. I just, I just lose like that. That's so okay. All right, let's restart. Let's restart. That <laughs> let doesn't count. Doesn't count. You, you saw, you saw, you didn't see anything. Okay. So let's go ahead. Let's put uh, la, 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 la. let's put Benjamin down. And then we'll have our free dart monkey, our free fart monkey. We'll put our, I guess we'll put him right here. And then now let's save up money because we're going to want to get the helicopter like ASAP he, okay? Our helicopter is very important because we're going to need to get that for the support Chinook to generate extra lives. So we can do bigger jets, IFR, downdraft, and then support Chinook. And that leaves us with only 15 lives. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's do, let's just lock in place. I feel like just locking this in place right here is the way to go. I'm getting a tech bot, and I'm putting a tech bot down, and I'm linking this tech bot to here, so that as soon as I can get lives, I'm getting lives. I ain't dealing with any of those shenanigans, okay? What else can we get that's gonna help us get lives? That's, that's the main question. That gave us 12 lives. That was not a lot of lives. That was, in fact, a very small amount of lives. So there's really, Benjamin can give us lives, Support Shinook can give us lives. What else can give us lives? Middle Path Druid. Spirit of the Forest can give us lives. If we can get upgraded and get Spirit of the Forest, that could be really beneficial. That could be great. How much does Spirit of the Forest cost? 295! 295 lives is crazy, though. That's bonkers. Does this have IFR, though? This does have IFR. So it can detect camo balloons. So what can we not pop right now? Lead balloons. We cannot pop lead balloons. What is jungle's bounty cost? 50 lives. Drew the jungle's only... That's only 10 lives. Wait. That's negative 95. Heart of the Oak is negative 95 lives. What the... What? Huh? Okay. Let's... Oh, he just waved at me. Hello, friend. All right. I think we're going to put... We're going to put... This is going to be our spirit of the forest. I kind of want to put him right in the middle. I, I can't see anything because the helicopter's in the way. We're going to put this guy right here. And this is going to be our Spirit of the Forest. So Thorn Swarm, that's free, and then Drew to the Jungle. That's only 20 lives. That's only 20 lives to get that. That's not expensive at all, actually. We can get a bunch of those for 20 lives each. And we can get a bunch of Drew to the Jungle. Drood, Drood, Drood of the jungle, strong as he can be. Wait, what's it like a true sun god temple cost? Like, if I wanted to buy that with lives, 4,000 lives? <laughs> 
I'm not gonna be able to get 4,000 lives. I think we need, I think we need another helicopter. Okay, we have, to, basically we need an increase in lives. We need to increase the consistently consistency of how quickly we generate lives. So let's think about it. I think Spirit of the Forest generates 25 lives per ability. I don't know how long the ability takes to cool down. This guy takes, that's 125, that's 40. So that's 165, 175, 185. So that's inherently 100 lives less for that ability. And this guy also does a pretty good job of popping balloons. Like, he's not great, but he also has downdraft. So I think that's going to work out really well. So maybe... Oh, man. What ability do we get? What do we borrow? I can also make sure I can get, like, an alchemist. Like, we can also get l very low-tier things that aren't going to cost that much. Like, a monkey sub with, like, longer ranges. Like, advanced, like... Look at that. Twin guns is tw oh, 20 lives. Okay, maybe that's a little expensive there. Maybe that's a little... A little presumptuous. I could get the jungle's bounty. Let's see. Plus extra cash. I need those lives, but it's really only 12 lives. I think we save sh straight for Spirit of the Forest. I know that sounds kind of greedy, but I think that might be the only way. But there's no way we're going to pop a Moab. There's no way we can pop a Moab while we're trying to save up for that. So I think we have to go ahead and we try to get another support Chinook. How much does quad darts cost? 35? 35 lives? 35 lives? I feel like I feel like a dad that's like angry at like the price. The 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 price of this cheeseburger is outrageous. Like my dad, whenever we go to like a restaurant, he always oh he always gets really angry at like. I mean, obviously things are getting overpriced, but he's like ten dollars for a cheeseburger. That's ridiculous. Back in my day, a cheeseburger was like thirty five cents. I was like, Dad, you're so old. Oh right, Benjamin. When's Benjamin getting his lives? I think Benjamin's generating five lives every round for us. Thank you, Benjamin. Very nice. I think we get another helicopter. I think that's the play. I think and I think we lock him in place here and we get bigger jets, IFR, downdraft, and then we can get a support Chinook. We're actually close to getting a support Chinook. And then with two support Chinooks, maybe possibly we might have enough money to be able to afford the Druid. We can buy T1 towers too. Like that is an, that is a possibility to be able to buy the T1 towers. And it's 125 lives, and we're at 103. So we're actually getting relatively close. We might be able to get two of them. Can we take out a Moab like this? I don't know if we can take out a Moab like this. I think we need to have this guy on follow mouse, and we need this guy. Well, I need both of them on follow mouse. Because I need this guy, and we're going to slow this down as soon as the Moab shows up. Because the Moab might be a little bit too difficult for us to defeat. Okay, come on. Come on. Thank you. Okay, we won, but we're not done. We're not done. I want to see how far we can get. I'd like to be able to beat round 80. Maybe round... I mean, I would love to just see how far we can get. We have 130 lives. I can get the next support Chinook. I'm buying... I'm getting another... I'm getting another tech bot, and you can't stop me. <laughs> okay, there we go. So there's two of those guys that are going to be generating even more lives for us now. I think the plan is we get the... Like, a Druid has 10,000 bots. The Druid is, like, soloing this game right now. Is there anything that we can't deal with, though? Regen farms could be pretty bad. Regen farms could be a little bit unfortunate for us to deal with. I could get some, like... we So, super monkeys... I think we can get super monkeys down, right? So, we can't upgrade them, but we can buy them. So, I am going to buy a couple of super monkeys just because we have so much money. Right? Like, getting some of these super monkeys could just be beneficial for dealing with, like large but we can't upgrade them right look how expensive it is to upgrade them another option we have another very very serious option that we need to consider is getting primary mentoring bigger radius and then we can get these are all make like t2 upgrades free so then we can get just primary towers and then just upgrade primary towers for free like tag shooters and bomb shooters specifically bomb shooters i think we could just get like frag bombs and heavy bombs i think we want spirit of the forest though so i can go ahead and buy jungle's bounty so there's Jungle's Bounty, so I need 295 lives. 295 lives is a lot of lives that we need. And not and having these things be the only camo detection is not ideal. That is not great. Oh no, regen balloons. Oh, is this gonna be am I creating a regen farm? I might be creating a regen farm right now. I don't know if I'm am I stopping the Oh no, okay. We're dealing with them fast enough. That was because if we create a regen farm, we just lose. We just lose. And what's even worse is since, like, we're always spending our money, we always have 
a very small amount of pops. Thank goodness we have these super monkeys. They're very, very nice to have. Oh, man. How's this guy doing? Okay, we have 67 lives. Will we be able to save up to get Spirit of the Forest in time? Or do I need... I think I need to get the... Hel I think I need to get the... Not the helicopter. The... The village. I really think I need to get a monkey village. And I think I want to put the monkey village right here. So that's the village. And we have 89 lives, so let's get Grow Blocker and let's also buy Radar Scanner. So that way this guy has camera detection now and everyone within this radius. So I can get bigger radius and then I can also buy Jungle Drums. And I get, look, I have 11 lives so I can buy Primary Training. Okay, so now I want to get, oh, it's only tier one upgrades for free. Increased range and it's fine, it's fine. That's, I think that's still the play because it's one upgrade that we can get for free and we're just gonna spam. I think we can get like bomb shooters down and we can just like figure out how to deal with that. So I need like one more life or something. There we go. Okay, so I can get primary mentoring now. So primary expertise is there's no way that's gonna happen. So I can just put down like, I can just put down, do we want, ta I think I want bomb shooters. I want bomb shooters and I can get extra range and I can get bigger bombs. Frag bombs are also only $5 or five lives. That's fine. We're just going to put down as many bomb shooters as we can because it doesn't cost any lives. And that's going to help us out tremendously. What about, do we want boomerang monkeys? Improved ranks? No, no, no. I think bomb shooters are probably going to be the best. Yeah, they're going to get a decent amount of pops. This is really ridiculous. Not going to lie. This is really ridiculous. Okay, I can get, let me get some more attack shooters. The more attack, because if I can get some of these attack shooters down in range, those will also be of great value. Can I put one more down? There we go. Perfect. So, more attacks. Even more attacks is free. Faster shooting. Okay, more attacks. Even more attacks. Faster shooting. I don't know why it's free, but it's free, so we take those. More attacks. Even more attacks. Okay. And then extra range. Bigger bombs. Extra range. Bigger bombs. Extra range. Bigger bombs. This is so silly. But hey, it's working. It's working, all right? All right, so now we do have taxpayer is only $5. What's overdrive? Uvu drive -oo. What is it? Level 14, I think. Level 14 cybersecurity is 10 lives per round. That doubles the amount of lives that Benjamin's going to be getting for us. Doubles, I say. So that's going to be really nice. We have 127. I really need to get this spirit of the forest. Oh my goodness. That's, that was really close. Oh, round 63. Oh, is this going to be... Okay, we barely, and I mean barely, was able to survive round six. Okay, I, I speak too soon. I speak too soon. Oh my gosh, that's terrifying. That is absolutely terrifying. How are these bomb shooters doing? They're getting... They're actually not doing too bad. I need to just keep putting these down. Our super monkeys are also doing very good. So maybe we do just want... Maybe we want, like, some more super monkeys down. Here, I'll just, like, put a bunch of super monkeys down over here. Because it doesn't cost any lives to initially buy them. So we're just going to get like an army of little super, of super monkeys down here. It's not going to do a lot, but it'll help. Let's see. I think getting rid of the super monkey is actually going to be the play. Because it allows me to put so many more bomb shooters in range over here. Look at that. I got like four bomb shooters in that area where that super monkey was. I'm just squeezing these bad boys in here. There we go. Nice. Okay. More attacks, even more attacks, faster shooting. More attacks, even more attacks, faster shooting. This is the most ridiculous. If I beat, I might be able to beat round 100. Maybe. Maybe. We're at 225. I need 295. And we're at 224. So we're getting close. Right now, Benjamin's not actually getting us any bonus lives until he gets to round level uh, 14. That's the goal. Okay, we just need to make everything free. We could get primary expertise. And it allows us to get these upgrades all for free as well. And I think that's the play after we get this guy upgraded. Look at that. We're at 248. And then we get primary expertise, which makes all of these things free so we can upgrade them all over again. Ooh, more, more attack shooters. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And do I have cross path? I don't have cross path on, which is a little sad. I'm so glad. I don't know why that either, even more attacks are free, but they are free. And... I'm very much so a fan of free right now. Oh my gosh. This is like... Yeah, that is organized. 248. 260. We need 295. Two more rounds. And then we can upgrade this guy. 
And then once this guy's upgraded to Spirit of the Forest, he's going to start generating us lives. Plus, Benjamin's also going to be level 14 soon. Once Benjamin's level 14, we're going to be in a really good spot. Like, a really, really good spot. Look at these bomb shooters. They're just going to town on them. I love that. 272, 284. One more. One more. Come on. 292. I, I can buy it with one life. I have one life, and I got Spirit of the Forest. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. So now we have the Spirit of the Forest, which is like in the perfect spot because for those of you who don't know, the Spirit of the Forest, the closer the track is in the Spirit of the Forest, the stronger the vines are. So we can actually move these guys. We, I'm going to I'm gonna have these guys, like, I'm going to lock these guys over here. I'm just going to have, okay, I don't want them, I don't know, that guy's going to be all over the place. Lock in place. All right, so, so I have, you can see where all the blue vines are the stronger vines. So since he's in the middle, we have all these like stronger vines right here. Plus we can do that, which gives us more lives. Yes, okay, now it's time for us to save up for primary expertise. Is Benjamin level 14 yet? Next one. Yes, next level. He needs level 14, baby. Primary expertise is 210 lives. I only have 70 lives right now. So what's that? I can't do math. I need 130 lives now because I just got the next. Oh, I got to make sure I keep using that ability because that ability gives me 25 lives. That's huge. I'm going to get a monkey farmer right here because that way he'll just pick up the lives when it drops. So I don't have to worry about collecting the lives either. As soon as we get this primary expertise, we can upgrade all of these again for free. We can get even faster shooting on all of them. And then we can also get the bomb shooters, the heavy bombs and frag bombs, which are an even bigger bonus. Plus the primary expertise is an attacking tower all on its own. So that's going to help out a lot. We're already at 160. Benjamin, get level 14, please. Please. Those 10 lives per round is crucial, I think. It's literally double the amount of lives. Literally having an extra five lives to deal with every single round is going to be so nice. And this druid is like, all right, that's le this is level 80. This is level 80. Will we be able to beat the DDTs? I have no idea. No idea. I don't think we have anything to deal with DDTs. That's one of the problems that we're facing right now. Unless I get, we need an MIB and I need an MIB right here. That's like the only option that we have. Okay, there we go. 210 primary expertise and so now free free cluster bombs are free why are cluster bombs free i don't know i don't 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 question the fact that cluster bombs are free okay that is the that is the greatest thing that i've ever seen in my entire life cluster bombs are free now baby that is so truly wonderful the fact that we have free cluster bombs i'm kind of tempted to get rid of the tax shooters now just because the you know that's free yeah, honestly, honestly, cluster bombs are free. That's a T3 for free. Yeah, all these gotta go. All these gotta go. All these gotta go. They're all gone. These are like T3 cluster. And if you can't fit them in range, it ain't worth it. Is this guy gonna like... I don't know if this... I don't, I'm still on this guy. I don't know if, he can, if he's in my way. He is in my way. Can I get? Can I get one more? No. That was a little greedy of me, wasn't it? Radar scanner and MIB, but that's 105 and I only have 100 lives, so we can't afford that just yet, my friends. So extra range, dry bombs, cluster bombs, heavy bombs. Nice. One, two. I have to be very careful because a misclick could lose me the game. Like actually a misclick loses the game. If I just buy too expensive of an upgrade that takes too many lives, there goes all my lives and now I lose. All right, what are we at? We're at round 89 right now. Nice. Extra bombs. I got to make sure we use that ability off cooldown as well. 99 lives. Okay. That does not matter. Those were DDTs. Those were indeed DDTs. Okay. This is getting ridiculous. Wait, let's try. Let's... I want to try something. Where can I put... Is there anywhere I can fit? That guy is taking up... It's free real estate. All right. We're going to put you right there. All right. Fast missile launcher. Okay. Moab Mauler does not work. And what about big bombs. Those are also not worth it. Okay, so cluster bombs are the way to go here. We have 200 lives. I could buy another T5, but what is a good T5 to buy? How much does perma spikes cost? Perma spikes are 255 lives. 255 lives. I really need to think about what is the option. What do I want to buy? Like, what is a good tower here that could really change things up? Do we have anything now that I would want to buy and change? All right, we're at round 95. I need to I need to think, think about something. I want a super glue monkey. I hate to say it, but I got to sell this guy. And I want to put a glue monkey right here. And I want stickier glue, stronger glue, Moab glue, 
relentless goo, and I want super glue, and then bigger globs, and then glue splatter. That's what I want. And then target, target strong, because I need this guy to glue the DDTs. And I need some extra lives. I need 225 lives. That's 184. All right, please. Please, I need some more lives. I need some more. I need some more lives so I can get the super glue. Please, I'm faking you, glue monkey. I'm begging you. Please give me some money. I don't know why I'm begging the glue monkey. All right, this has been an. It, this is. Oh my gosh, this dude has 500,000 pop. Thank goodness we got this dude. There we go. 241. Boom, super glue. All right, the super glue is going to be super nice, especially because so glue so strong it temporarily immobilizes all affected balloons. All right. Now we need to start getting ready for that that dreaded BAD. What can we buy that's gonna just shred the BAD? What's just gonna absolutely annihilate this guy? This this village almost has 200,000 pops too, so this village is also doing a great job. Wait, is that not in range? There's no way. Wait, wait, bigger radius. I'm gonna get the bigger radius because that's enough lies. It wasn't in range. That means I can buy more bomb shooters. Oh, round 100, my friends. All right, we can do this. We can do this. We can beat round 100, right? Okay, wait. Wait. It's okay. I think we got it. I'm pretty sure we got it. Famous last words. Very famous last words. Missile launcher. Bigger bombs, heavy bombs. Target strong. I don't know why I had to target strong. I have 100 lives. What can oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Right when it gets to the middle. And then we're going to use the explosion ability. Boom! Let's go, my friends. That was actually a really difficult challenge, not gonna lie. I was not ready for that. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications. Lives are important. I was not ready for that. Thank, thank you. Thank you, Spirit of the Forest, for guiding us 